video is sponsored by me, Shelby Frick, with Fairy Tale Concierge. We are working hard for you to save you time, headaches, and money. I can create a package for any Disney vacation that you would like to plan. Family trips, adult-only trips, business outings. If you have young children, if you have older children, you name it, I can plan it and make it magical for you. I am a Disney expert. I know all about the resorts, the dining plans, the My Disney Experience, dining reservations, fast passes, the parks, characters, the cruise ships, the staterooms, and itineraries, and so much more. My service is free of charge when you book with me. What does this mean? Well, my services include dining reservations, fast pass reservations, itineraries. I personalize itineraries for your vacation to save you time that you are not wasting in line. That way you can enjoy the parks and your vacation. I will continuously monitor, monitor for discounts. I have advice. I can do recommendations. I am here to answer all of your questions, and I will wait on hold for you with Disney. If you've ever done it, you know it can be a daunting process. I am here to do it for you. I am committed to providing you a magical vacation that will help you create a memory that will last a lifetime. Hi, everybody. It is Shelby, and I have some water park news for you. The magic keeps coming. I feel like this week, Especially, so you know, hopefully it will continue. So, Disney is going to open one of their water parks. They have two water parks they have Blizzard Beach and Typhoon Lagoon, and they're going to open one water park on March 7th of 2021. No word on which water park, we just know that they will be opening one water park. They're saying they, of course, can adjust the proposed reopening date, and if that happens, they will let us know and expect a future update. So that's, you know, it's always fluid, but something to look forward to. So some guests have existing tickets, and some annual pass holders are impacted by this update. If you have the Park Hopper Plus option or the Water Park and Sports option and you are visiting before March 7th of 2021, because they did sell these tickets in 2021. So it still seems like they're going to be park hopping in 2021. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Um, you can either, you have three options. You can keep your tickets, your current date-based tickets with the existing add-ons, because there are other add-ons and experiences for your visit that are not water parks. You can modify your tickets, all right? And if you have any questions about that, please let me know, or you can cancel your tickets as well. So at this time, um, guests can purchase new tickets that include the Park Hopper Plus option or the Water Park and Sports option for admission for March 7th, 2021 and later. And Disney will be resuming the sales of Water Park annual passes and the one-day Water Park ticket at a later date. So keep that in mind. They are going to automatically extend any unused, unexpired one-day Water Park tickets through December 31st of 2021. And if you cannot use it by then, you may also cancel that ticket. That's another alternative that you have. So if you have any questions, please let me know. My email is down below as well as my business Facebook page. You can message me on there, post a comment. Please check it out. I would really appreciate some likes. And some subscriptions to this, to this channel would be great as well. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time.